Hello and welcome to another Light Reading sponsored video. My name is Phil Harvey. I'm the editor in chief of Light Reading and uh, joining me today is Mr. Chow from CTE. And um, we're here to talk about the Leading Lights Awards. Uh, this was our 20th anniversary Leading Lights Awards. And um, it was probably among the most competitive we've ever had in terms of the quality of entries, uh, the technologies covered, and and the companies involved. And so to get into this awards process and get to be a finalist was certainly an accomplishment. To be a winner um, was, was even all the more remarkable. And that's why we're talking with CTE today. Um, so uh, first of all, uh, congratulations on winning the most innovative RAND product or solution award. Um, ZTE won for its UBR solution. And my first question is, um, can you explain how the UBR solution um, addresses some key customer challenges that are evolving in the uh, uh, mobile network landscape? Okay, thank you. Uh, actually, there are uh, several uh, critical pain points from uh, operators in the whole industry, uh, especially with the mobile network evolve, uh, evolves. The uh, there are uh, several uh, points like the more and more frequency bands, more and more technologies from 2G to 5G, and the limited uh, tower space and uh, higher operational costs. So our UBR Pioneer solution is aimed to resolve all these uh, critical issues. Uh, I'd like to highlight several points. The first one is uh, our UBR solution is aimed to uh, integrate the IF modules in three main uh, dimensions, the multiple uh, sectors in one, multiple bands in one, and multiple channels in one. All this will allow our operators to build uh, significantly uh, simple, uh, simple and efficient site. And uh, one more, I'd like to introduce our three sectors in one UBR. This integrates three sectors into one radio unit, significantly reduce the tower space requirement. We offered the industry unique middle band 12T, 12R UBR supporting dual band across three sectors in one single unit, and each sector with 44R capability. Combined with our low band 6T, 6R uh, UBR, operators can support a full site with five bands across three sectors using just two radio units. So all of this can reduce the tower space of our operators and even more reduce their power consumption. And even we have more uh, UBR series products like triple band UBR, cord band UBR, and pattern uh, band UBR. All of this equipment can help the operators to evolve to the future 5G and the future evolution and save all the OPEX for them. Yeah, that's a, that's a, a, a an outstanding overview of what uh, of of the challenges that they're facing and how you address them with the UBR solution um just to kind of review, you know, it taking on the challenge of of uh, accommodating their limited tower space um energy efficiency and much better use of energy and then without compromising performance and ease of use and that's really what um you know our judges in the leading lights process saw as um as a standout item is that uh, uh you know uh, the miniaturization and the energy efficiency and the performance all kind of came together in the solution um, so we know it's highly innovative. Um, can you elaborate on some of the technological breakthroughs that that kind of underpin uh, the UBR innovations and what sort of makes what made it possible uh, to create such a device? Uh, yes, sure. Uh, actually, ZT 
invested a lot to the innovative solutions, especially for our RAM products. Uh, I'd like to introduce three points for the uh, the most advanced technologies. The first one is our Super N power amplify technology. This is a unique ZT innovation. Our power amplify maintain near constant efficiency across all load levels, which is particularly impressive at low load. We can achieve around three times of the efficiency of current industry standards. Our UBR equipped with super N amplifiers can reduce overall uh, power consumption by around 35 percentage comparing to the industry norms. And the, the second one is our dynamic cross-sector power sharing technology. Just uh, by using our three sector in one UBR, it can it can be intelligent power, alloc power allocation based on real-time traffic demands across different sectors. So this will optimize our power resource utilization and improve the bit, bit energy utilization by around 20% per watt. That means with 20% more data can be transferred under the same power consumption. And the third point is our adaptive power management schedule. We've implemented a system that can selectively shut down the internal processing units based on the traffic load. Particularly in low traffic mode, we can initiate a near complete shutdown of UBR. That means it can enter a deep hibernation mode, especially when the traffic is uh, very, very low. So based on such kind of uh, technology, our UBR's power consumption can be reduced to as low as three watts. That means almost a zero bit, zero watt state. So our UBR Pioneer solution is uh, based on our latest uh, chipset, our architectures and, and our algorithms to achieve these advantages. So from different levels, uh, like the chip level up to the whole network level to reduce the power consumption, which can put the technology as the boundaries of what's possible in RAN technology. Yeah, another excellent point. I think um, you know the background of uh, ZTE's investment in in research and development across the whole stack of technologies, not just like you said, not just the hardware, the core hardware, also the chipsets, also the software, and then bringing it all together is how you can kind of have exert that level of control over how much energy you're using. And then also, like I said, kind of what we were impressed by is being able to have that energy efficiency and then still not compromise as the data rates increase and the and the usage increases. Okay, I've got one more question because this is also a component of our um, Leading Lights program is that we try to, you know, judge products um, that are going to either that already have had market acceptance or are uh, um, are positioned for key market acceptance. And so I so my last question is, can you share some examples uh, of market success and the tangible benefits that you're delivering to customers with the UBR solution? Uh, yes, uh, actually the uh, market reception of our UBR solution is uh, uh, exceptionally uh, positive. Actually, uh, our success is in several key areas. Uh, first of all, uh, in terms of uh, industry recognition, both Omdia and uh, global data, these two leading industry analysts rated ZT uh, RAM products as leaders uh, since 2023. Uh, especially, they acknowledge it our innovations in multiple band and multiple sectors uh, UBR solutions. And uh, 
Furthermore, our new generation of uh, UBR products has been commercially deployed uh, over in over 30 operators all over the world. And this rapid adoption means the solution is uh, very rec recognized by our customers. And we have already deployed over 6,000 of our three sectors in one UBR in Africa, in the uh, middle of uh, Europe and uh, Thailand. And 10 more other projects are ongoing. So all of this will also push our maturity of this technology. And one of our most uh, compelling examples from uh, Thailand, uh, Chu as the operator, they implemented our uh, 12T, 12R UBR to replace traditional UBRs in their existing network. This result has some uh, remarkable uh, influence. We have seen an 83 percentage reduction in the number of RF modules per site and around a 60 percentage decrease in the total weight of RF modules. And uh, according to the statistics, it can reduce the energy consumption around 4,000 kilowatt hour per year. All these uh, cases means uh, our operators and our customers accept our UBR solution very much. Yeah, I think that's um, um, very clear that it's having success in the market. And um, and and I, I uh, really appreciate you bringing out the specifics there because it does help to um, uh, for us to be able to uh, uh, look and see what success operators are having, how they're serving their customers, and then, um, you know, what efficiencies they're gaining as uh, as they're building their networks. Um, Mr. Chow, this has been a, 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 a real pleasure. Thanks so much for, for taking the time. And once again, uh, congratulations to ZTE for winning the uh, Most Innovative RAN Product or Solution Leading Lights Awards in our 20th year. Okay, thank you very much.